Welcome back to Parlor TV. Thank you. Um, I think we profiled you the first time in like 2008. Yes. And um, now we have this new album coming out. Tell us Boy the title. Who is that? All of me. Okay. All of me. Yeah. Right. I'm excited, man. It took me a few years, but I'm back. I had to go and live and grow through some things and write about them, you know. And finally, thank God, I'm at a place where I feel like I'm good and happy and ready for it to come out, you mm. know. People to know and see. My whole thing with my albums is I write about my life experiences because that's what works for me, right. you know. It's harder for me to like just be given songs and say, you know, do the rotation, the robot rotation and just be like boom, boom, boom and it's out. Right. I don't, I have to go and sing these songs and really convince people to buy them. Mm -hmm. If they don't feel them and I don't feel them, then they're not going to buy them. My whole thing that I learned from my, all my relationships is I was making the same mistake with the same type of guy mm -hmm. and toughing it out and being so hard headed about it that it was, it was me, it wasn't even them. I was like, this isn't even it. I'm making the same mistakes. I'm doing the wrong things. I'm enabling you. The same person with a different face. Same person with a different face. But my mum was, you know, she never like, really put it out there, but she was kind of like, yeah. you know, when I rekindled my relationship with my dad, I was 23, so she was also was like, why is he, what's he doing? Where are you going? Ma, really? What's all this lipstick for? What is this? You know, and then she was like, yeah, I kind of seen your dad again. I was like, ah, la, 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 I don't want to see this here, this, oh my goodness. That's I turned into a five-year-old, it's amazing. Um, but then again, like I said, at that time I just got into a relationship, I was kind of like, look, whatever makes you happy. <laughs> he's, he's my dad, I guess, and he's cool, we cool. Right. You know, like, he's not really my father, right. but he's my dad, you know, mm -hmm. and um, That's it was... That's interesting, because I think yeah. about that in the same way as my stepfather. Right. And he had to kind of grow into that role. Yeah. In the beginning, I was very much like you, hey mom, you know, I'm 14, if that's what you want to rock with, I'm happy for you. As long okay. as you make my mom happy, I'm going to school. Yeah. Work it out. Exactly. And All of that. that. Right. But that's interesting that you mm -hmm. feel that way about your actual yeah, I'm like, like he was. Dad. He was never my father. He was never the guy that grew me or anything like that. But he come around now, and he's come around now, and he's he's made um he's made sense of certain things, you know. And and my parents are very non-judgmental and really like you're gonna live and you're gonna make mistakes and do them and just you know try and do it from a a very good moral standpoint. Try and do your best. What's happening? This is Stella. You are watching Parlor TV.